Hi everyone! Today I will be showing you a cool square knot pattern which is called the Secret River Bar. Let's get started. For this pattern we're going to need two different colors of rope. I am using 4 millimeter braided cord and I'm going to attach both ropes together with a lark's head knot and I'm going to hold my color rope in the middle so that both ropes are in between the solid color. Just like that. Once my ropes are attached, I'm going to start by tying a half square knot. So I'm going to take the end here on the right, cross it over my two ropes that are in the middle, then the rope here on the left goes over that, behind the two in the middle, and through the loop. And before I tighten this all the way, we're going to make our first little bar. So I'm going to take this colored rope here on the right and I'm just going to twist it over and into the loop here that is on the right side. So it just came up and curled around everything to come through that loop. And now I'm going to take both sides here of my solid color and just pull it up top. And then I'm going to pull down on my colored rope to tighten it up and I'm just going to adjust until everything is tight and it should look something like that and now I'm going to go through and do the other side of my square knot so now I take my left side to cross over the two in the middle this string here on the right goes over that then behind the two and through the loop and again, before I tighten this, I'm going to take the string here on the left to curl up and through the loop on the left. Okay, so it came up, went around everything, and through that loop. And then I'm just going to take these and pull them tight. And then I t tug on this one to c tighten up my bar. And that is what it should look like all finished up and then we just keep repeating these steps so it's actually a pretty simple pattern but it's also really unique and beautiful so it's an extra fun way to change up your square knot sentence so I'm just doing another half square knot from the right side before I tighten it I take the string here on the right curl it around everything and through that loop then I pull to tighten and then I give this one a little tug to tighten up that center loop just like that and now I'm gonna go through and finish my square knot take this piece it goes over and through the loop Give everything a nice tug to tighten. Now, sometimes when you use different material for this knot, so if you kind of have that three ply twisted, it might be a little rougher to just pull um, to tighten. So you'll probably have to, uh, to spend a little more time adjusting that and just making sure everything places where it needs to be. But you can honestly use any material you want. <laughs>
And this is what it should look like once you get quite a few in a row. As you can see, the colored in the middle, it zigzags. And it is just a really fun, different way you can do that long chain of square knots, whether you're making a bracelet, a keychain, part of a plant hanger, or a belt, I don't know, anything really. This is just beautiful. And it's another cool way you can add a pop of color into your knots. And I just really hope you guys found this video helpful and inspiring. And thank you so much for watching.